Hey everyone, welcome back to another Monkey in the Wild. Now, again, I keep saying this, but this is going to be a different one. I noticed when I was leaving Pleasure House Point the other day, and I was driving over the Lesnar Bridge, that there were a shit ton of Osprey flying pretty much at bridge level. Of course, down below, Chesapeake Bay, right at the inlet to the river that goes to Pleasure House Point. So, my guess is that they're probably just a bunch of fish that are there, and they're fishing. I mean, there's a bunch of gulls and things like that too, so I thought, hmm, that might be something that I could do. But, obviously I can't stop in the middle of the bridge, so I had to park at the other end of Pleasure House Point, and now I'm hoofing it over to the bridge, and I gotta walk eh, about a third of the way across maybe even a half. Like right now, I could see one, two, three Osprey up above this hotel, which is at the very end of this bridge. So I think I'm gonna try to get some footage. I have the A6700 with a 70 to 200 with a 1.4 times extender on it. And of course I have a uh, ND filter, variable ND filter on it because it's pretty bright out. And I'm gonna shoot at 60 frames per second just so I can possibly slow it down. I'm hoping that this won't be as jerky. I did a little test this morning, and I put the 500 millimeter Sigma on this A6700, and I went through the various settings for stabilization, and it's still jerky. And then I put the 70 to 200 on it, and it's not jerky. So I have satisfied my own curiosity, and that the Sigma lens just doesn't perform as well in video with stabilization as a Sony lens. All right, it's gonna get loud here because we're coming up on traffic and this dude's got his motorcycle revving. So let's uh, go over here and see what we can find. into the water here and getting fish. So you can see them all They're all over the place. Just hovering until they see a fish and then they swoop down in and smash into the water and well, sometimes they get them. If you can't tell, it is like a wind tunnel. I took my
Okay, so that was insane. I, I mean, I, I can't tell you how fun that was. Okay, now, God, the wind, is, it's actually got my hearing all wonky because it was just continually whipping into my face. I mean, not that there's any less wind here, but oh, right up there on that bridge, it's literally like a tunnel. Ugh. But either way, I had a lot of fun. Don't know if any of this stuff is gonna be usable. I'm sure some of it will be, but we'll find out. Okay, so I'm not gonna blather on for this episode like I always do. I'm just gonna say I had fun shooting Osprey off the Lesnar Bridge and didn't even think to go there because I watch Mark Smith, I believe it is, and I'm like, man, where does that guy go where he gets this diversity of birds all like fishing and hunting and all that shit. Well, now I know. I can go right there and I can get osprey and it looked like pelicans. Again, hard to see. My eyes are still watering from how much wind was whipping into my face. As an aside, this place right here behind me is the first place that I lived when I moved to Virginia Beach. That's pretty much all I got for you this time, which is a lot because I had so many birds to shoot. <laughs> so here we go. Get off the couch, get off your ass, get out of your house, go out and enjoy nature. Go for a walk. Even if you don't take any pictures or videos, just get out there and enjoy it while you can. Because sometimes you can't, and I know what that's like and it sucks. So hopefully you enjoyed this and hopefully you'll be back for the next one and I'll see you that next time. Bye-bye.